welcome back to the Chris Grant Racing Complex. It does look a little different this time because it's not exactly an oval anymore. It has been transformed into the road course part of the Speedway. And we have 34 of NASCAR's biggest gladiators here to take on this beast. And let's look at our ones to watch here today. Kyle Larson on the pole again. The second time this season that Kyle Larson has gotten a pole. And he's starting right next to Denny Hamlin. This will go real well. Totally. Kyle Larson has not won a race since the first ever race in Chris Craft Cup Series history. That was his first and only win that he's had. So, he's looking to get it done here today. And then starting in third, we got Kimi Raikkonen, a former F1 driver looking to get his first ever win in the Chris Craft Cup Series here in the Trackhouse Racing number 91. This is his third start of the season, of course. He is go he went full times this season with the Chris Craft Cup Series with Trackhouse Racing. So we'll see how he does here on the road course. William Byron, he has yet to get a win in the Chris Craft Cup Series. He's looking for his first one today and is starting fifth, so we'll see how that goes for him. Ross Chastain also looking for his first win. It got stolen from him at the Daytona International Speedway when he got dumped on the last lap going down the back straightaway. He collected Alex Bowman, and they both ended up wrecking. So we'll see if he can get redemption and maybe get a win today. And then the road course ringer, A.J. Allmendinger, is back with the Chris Craft Cup Series for the first time since season number two ended. So, he's a really good at road courses. We're going to have to see how he does here today. And he's going to be a factor for that win, I'm pretty sure. And then, a little bit further behind him, you got Chase Elliott looking for his first win of the season. His season has not started off very well so far, so he's looking to capitalize here today at the road course and hopefully get his first win of the season. And that's starting back here in 31st, Michael McDowell, the current Chris Craft Cup Series points leader. Things are not looking too well so far for the front row motorsports number 40, 34, excuse me, but he's looking to make his way up through the field and possibly get a good finish here today. And then rounding out the field is going to be Ryan Blaney. Just because of an inspection failure, this car is extremely fast, so I wouldn't be surprised if we see Ryan Blaney back out front by the end of this thing. And those are your drivers to watch out for. And now for the most famous words in motorsports, giving the command to fire the engines here at the Chris Crab Racing Complex Road Course, Wyclef John. Driver! And Kevin James is going to be tough to beat, but what a great command. Let's get down to business. Here is your starting lineup. On the front row, you got NASCAR Dude and Ream Cup Series Racing Network. In row two, you have Kimi Raikkonen and Blake Plays. In row three, you got MLCS Racing Network and Bryce Lamb. In row four, you got Josh Berry and Speed Cup Stop Motion. In row five, you got Carson Hosevar and Daniel Hemrick. In row 6, welcome back AJ Allmendinger and Jamin Horton. In row 7, you got Hardy's Worker 1000 and Daniel Suarez. In row 8, you got Bubba Wallace and Chris Buescher. In row 9, you got Aiden Clips and Ricky Stenhouse Jr. In row 10, you got Austin Dillon and Todd Gilliland. In row 11, you got Connor Daly and Corey LaJoy. In row 12, you got NASCAR 77 and Chase Briscoe. In row 13, you got Eric Jones and Speedway Racing Network. In row 14, you got Tristan Ratchwalski and Andy. In row 15, you have Harrison Burton and the Crane Cup Series. In row 16, you got Michael McDowell and John Hunter Nemechek. And in the final row, you got Austin Sindrick and the best YT username. Ladies and gentlemen, the cars are lined up and we are ready to go here for the first time at the road course in the Chris Craft Racing Complex. The pace car pulls in and the green flag is in the air. We are racing at the Chris Draft Racing Complex. 
Larson takes the early lead, but here comes Chastain with a huge run up the second. And now he's going to hunt down the five car, looking for that race lead. He's going to have it off of six. Larson looks back up the inside. It's not going to be enough there. AJ Allmendinger in hot pursuit of them. Chastain leads the first lap. Larson is all over the rear bumper of the one car. Here comes Allmendinger around the outside, looking for the lead. He's going to lose a couple spots. Here comes Josh Berry up in the second now. Chastain continues to lead the way. Josh Berry's going to have a run going into two. Not going to work out there. He's going to try again here in turn five. He's got the lead, but Chastain's going to put the bumper to him, and he's into the wall hard. Caution is out for the first time today. Josh Berry hard into the wall, and looking at the horrible quality tire of the PTC mold, Josh Berry's day is over as he has a broken toe link on that number four car. Let's see if we can get a replay of what happened. Chastain was trying to get around him, and oh, put the bumper to him. Oh, no. And that ended Barry's day. There's going to be some words with those two after this race is over. There's the choose cone. Chastain on the inside. Almendinger on the outside. Here we go. We're coming back to green. Almendinger's going to get the jump this time. And he's going to quickly move down to the bottom and block Chastain. Here comes Chastain with a huge one. He's going to turn him. He's holding the wall upside down. Almendinger with a violent flip. And Chastain is the culprit yet again. But this time he could not escape the mess as Ross Chastain ends up plowing into the outside wall in turn two as a violent flip for AJ Allmendinger takes place. And there is now lightning in the area. We have pulled the cars onto pit road and now it's gonna start raining. So we're under a rain delay now. Luckily, both drivers are okay as they are out of their cars and they're discussing right now. Allmendinger clearly not happy. And oh, we got a conflict in turn two. Punch is being thrown, and the safety officials are there to break up the fight quickly. Man, a lot of drama going on here at the Chris Grab Racing Complex road course. Ross Chastain wrecks two drivers to hopefully try and win and ends up wrecking himself out as well. And it ends up in a conflict in turn two, a physical conflict, I should say. As we're going to get a look at the replay of what even happened going into turn two here on the restart. Chastain had a run coming down. Oh, and got into the rear quarter panel of him. And Almendinger hit the wall just right to make the car go upside down. Man, a violent crash to end the day. Not only for those two drivers, but we're going to have to call the race off. And Kyle Larson, the first ever winner in the Chris Craft Cup Series, finally wins another race. This time by luck and mother nature. Let's get through a rundown of your race results. Thanks, Mother Nature. Kyle Larson takes home the win. Daniel Suarez second, William Byron third, Ryan Blaney fourth, and Austin Sindrick in fifth. Chase Elliott sixth, Joey Logano seventh, Brad Keselowski eighth, Ryan Priest ninth, and Kimi Raikkonen rounds out the top 10. Noah Gregson 11th, Denny Hamlin 12th, Ricky Stenhouse Jr. 13th, Bubba Wallace 14th, and Kyle Busch 15th. Chris Borcher 16th, Austin Dillon 17th, Carson Hersebar 18th, Mark Church Jr. 19th, and Alex Bowman 20th. Daniel Hemmer 21st, Chase Briscoe 22nd, Connor Daly 23rd, Michael McDowell 24th, and Christopher Bell 25th. Todd Gilliland 26th, Eric Jones 27th, Harrison Burke 28th, Corey LaJoy 29th, and Ty Gibbs 30th. John Hunter Nemechek 31st, AJ Allmendinger 32nd, Ross Chastain 33rd, and unfortunately rounding out the field after having a good start to the day was the four of Josh Berry. Well, that was one way to end the race. Wow, what an incident to call the caution for, and um, Mother Nature ruins it yet again for the Chris Grab Cup Series. The third season in a row, we cannot escape Mother Nature. It always happens at least once, but Kyle Larson's got a reason to celebrate as he is your race winner today, and this will affect him pretty good in points, as he was eighth coming into this race, and we'll see where that puts him later on. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so much for watching race number three of season number three of the Chris Grab Cup Series. So sorry that it was cut short, but unfortunately, we cannot control the weather. Thank you again, Mother Nature, sarcastically. Anyway, for race number four, we are headed to a new track. It's an actual, actually an inverted oval. It is called the Lucas Oil Raceway. It's an inverted oval, so the tri-oval, instead of facing out like at Daytona, it's facing in. 
So that'll be interesting to see for the first time in the Chris Craft Cup Series. Thank you all so much for watching. Chris Craft signing out.